Uh, my name is Howard Moore, and I live in Stonewall, Manitoba, just outside of Winnipeg. Um, for um, for over 35 years, uh, my wife and I have been uh, members of a mission agency called Greater Europe Mission. And 18 of those years, uh, we were in France and ministering in France and uh, raised our family there, actually, enjoyed it very much. And then I came back and I was the Canadian director for our mission organization based just outside of Toronto. And there was there for 13 years. But now we've moved back to Manitoba where we we're originally from. And uh, I am now a representative just part time, but I'm a representative for the same organization called Greater Europe Mission. And so I go to schools and churches different places, just talking about ministry in Europe, uh, etc. Um, also, I during that time, uh, a couple of years ago, I joined the board of uh, Mission Fest Manitoba. So I am directly affiliated with Mission Fest Manitoba as a board member. Wonderful. Well, that's amazing. I would love to sit down and hear your testimony sometime, but we don't have time for that today. Um, I would love to know, how are you feeling about this event now that it's been, you know, two years and we get to be back in person? Well, I, I, I'm feeling really excited about it. Uh, I think the fact that it had to be changed, even because of COVID, it had to be put later has really got some blessings as well as some challenges. The challenges is, you know, people are normally looking at it being in February. And so to see it actually having to be changed, um, I've had some response from some people saying, oh, that's too bad because I've already got this other commitment that uh, is going to make it difficult. But the good thing about it is, of course, this time of the year, normally we don't have the threat of snowstorms and especially real <laughs> severe cold um, as we might have in February. So I think in some ways that's exciting. Um, will give us an opportunity, even though, of course, we had a big storm that just came through a few days ago uh, that also created a problem. But I am looking for it after two years of not being able to see people together under uh, the name of, of Mission Fest Manitoba, where we have the opportunity just to kind of focus on what God is doing in our midst, uh, in our city, in our province, in our country, but also what he's doing around the world. And so I'm looking forward to that, listening to the speakers and just interacting with people. Uh, that's what I'm looking forward to. Yeah, I think it's going to be a really good time. Um, what can people expect that are thinking about going to Mission Fest this year? Well, um, I think what you can expect is really is hearing some good speakers who are uh, speakers who they they are people who've had opportunity to be involved in ministry, and there's a variety of different ministries represented by uh, these people that are going to be there. And they're going to be able to share their passion, uh, what's on their heart, what God has led them to do, stories about how God has worked while they've been involved in ministry. And I know we're going to hear some burden coming through as they share, you know, about needs that are there in relation to their ministry. So, um, and then we got we got these breakout sessions that are going to be that's where breakout sessions are smaller uh, smaller events where you're going to have some people who again are very experienced in different ministries who are going to be able to share a little bit more practically about how to be involved in ministry in different ways or helping you to understand what are some of the things involved in ministering specifically to groups of people or types of ministry. So, so I think that's going to be good. And then, of course, the big thing is just 
you're out there with all the different booths and uh, different organizations. It's an opportunity to just go and say, wow, I've heard about this organization. Can you tell me a little bit more about what you do and so forth? So it's it's a, a wonderful smorgasbord of ministries, I guess you would say, that you can just go and taste uh, and find out more information about. Yeah, and see what God is doing here in Manitoba and then around the world, all in one place. That's right. That's so right. Yeah. Well, I think the event is going to be really good. Thank you so much, Howard, for the time and for sharing your heart. And okay. uh, yeah, looking forward to it. Okay. Thank you so much, Sylvia.